the MIGF last year, we actually learned that like um, uh, we don't need to prepare so many things. <laughs> actually, where we actually over prepared, and um, we we didn't know what to expect because it 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 was our first year. So yeah, we kind of over prepare. But this year, I think we are more prepared that uh, we we know how to you know sort of uh, uh, prepare correct portions and and uh, this year we have a clearer direction of where yeah. we are heading in comparison to last year where because we are just so blur and vague yeah we, we get overwhelming uh, response from the diners and all that and you know most of them that came and dined and they said oh my god we saw you guys on uh, MIGF and you know this is the dish that you guys did and all that and you know we, we would like to try that so it's sort of not just um, it will make us very happy that you know people actually recognize uh, what we are doing and you know, usually what we do over here at the Upper Deck, um, not everybody would be able to accept that. When, when, yeah, and when we always tell people to come to Upper Deck with an open mind, uh, but you know, MIGF actually uh, sort of like tell them that you know, uh, this, is, this is the direction that Tanzini is going. So you know, when you guys come and dine, come with an open mind. So you know, it, it saves us that, that, that energy to go and tell people that come with an open mind because MIGF has already uh, sort of like do that for us. I, I'm actually a food science based uh, uh, person and uh, you know and I decided that you know food science you know is something that I learn about to know more about the food but then again I just find that it needed more than that you know I, I, I need I needed to go into that artistry side of food not just very technical and very hard science and things yeah. like that so therefore I decided to you know switch to uh, you know do culinary as you know so um, uh, it's called food services administration. So you know what we do is that we do a little bit of cooking and of course all the technicalities of food science and all that. Well, I actually love um, uh, Pierre Gagné very much. He is very uh, you know straightforward, classical uh, French chef. But um, you know he always put a twist into whatever that he's doing. And you know when you see that dish, he sort of like own it. And you know you see that he say, oh, that's that's you know Gagné's dish. So you know that that's one person that I really look up to. Well, actually, this year, one of the star of the dish uh, is basically the giant tiger grouper from our very own farm. You know, um, we are in the green building and we're always looking for sustainable produce, sustainable vegetables, sustainable seafood and meat and all that. The giant tiger grouper is actually our very own pride. Like, you know, we, we bred the fish ourselves. We have a sea cage in uh, Trangano, our own farm. And it's actually a crossbreed. It's it's not a it's it's not a GMO. It's not a genetically modified, uh, you know, uh, product. But it's actually naturally bred. So that is the one that we want to highlight this year.